Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Sandrock where it is that time. It is diaper change time. I'm guessing that for the last two or three days Logan has been changing the diapers because it certainly wasn't me doing it. Uh, I will feed you. Uh, I will. What are you doing Logan? I need to interact what with this baby. What are you planning for today? I'm uh, not too busy right I'm now. saying the baby needed a diaper change. I can change. be with you if you want. But I, I, d I could only see the feeding option. Maybe maybe it took a diaper away when I did the feeding option. I did not check very well on that one. I will try the toy cat statue today. That is a liked one. Very nice. I will say hello to Logan. He keeps trying to pick up the baby, so <laughs> I probably should let him do that. Because it is the most adorable thing in the whole wide world. I can't wait until you go in, grow into a little toddler. Because toddlers are adorable. Even if they are little menacing monsters that get into everything. They're still adorable. Okay. Time to go. And try and find the rest of my relics, I think. Um, I've been trying to slowly but surely get through various commissions and things like that, talk to people. Festival badges are cool and all, but I just don't know. Well, that's something I can hand straight in at least. I'm not really worrying too much about commissions. <laughs> so far ahead of everybody else, it's just not even funny. Venti has something for me, so I will have a chat. Have you started on the airship? I've never heard of such a massive project, but I believe you can do it amazingly well. You've always been the most awesome builder I've ever met. Even a ship like this couldn't stump you. Honestly, I'd probably be further on with the ship if I didn't have to talk to every single person in Sandrock about the things that they have to help me with the ship. But we'll get there. Don't worry, Venti. I love you. Here, take these with you. They're all scrap materials I personally scavenged. It'd be great if they could help you out. Actually, talking about scrap, I really could do just for some extra inventory space with going to the factory and going through all of my scrap and just getting it recycled because we've got a lot of stuff. Some stuff is too big for the actual queues. And I need to put the water that Burgess gave me. Um, and I need to take that and I need to put it, but this is so much better waiting a few days to do these things because then I don't have to do like four at a time or something. I can just get that done. I'm not desperate for any of the proceeds of this scrap recycling. I'm just gonna save it all up and then do it in a big old batch. But that does mean I'm going to need to... I think there was some copper right up here that needs a second queue. So we're using 14 out of our 22 crafting slots. Um, I need to make... No, I don't need to make any manganese steel bars. I could do another batch of smelting pretty soon, but maybe I'll do the recycling first. Someone has a gift for me. Ugh. From Cooper, here is some meat. Thank you, love Cooper. That's what that said. Um, Dear Sheila, that's great. Your pa and I are going to have to come and see, but maybe there's something more suitable than a roller coaster. I'm a little worried about your pa's blood pressure. Love you lots. Ah. Loads of stuff. Probably should have picked that up before I put the scrap on. Yeah. It's annoying. So what I'm going to do is find a suitable box. Large storage. Uh, I'm going to call this one scrap. And I'm going to start storing scrap in it because I'm fed up of seeing it in my inventory. There we are. Done. Well, quite a few relics that we found last time. So we'll put those away. Do a little sort. And we've mostly got toys, baby stuff. And um, honestly, we do have like 
processors and mountain management ships and things and engines and things so that they could easily go away. Shiny scorpion doesn't need to be there. I could go in like fish or something. I don't know. I doubt that most of the baby stuff needs to be here either. But it's fine. I'll just put, put things away a bit at a time. All of those desk clocks for Jane could be sold as well because I didn't end up using them. Right, so I could go and hand in the manganese steel bars. Or I could just go straight, and I think I will just go straight out to the mole cave. Mia desire something. <laughs> oh, you know what? And it's really annoying, but I haven't given pebbles a present in forever and i am getting really behind on that and it's getting really annoying so i feel like maybe i should just do my bits around town first as irritating as it is i just want to go and find those bits that i need in the, in the mines no i've had my eye very off the ball thank you with uh I'm glad a Mia lot of the social to stuff. Here. We can never have too many botanists in Sandrock. That's very true. I knew he could do it. Sandrock really needed this. Pablo? I'm thinking. See ya. Uh, deputy captain down here. I never get tired of the little sort of rearing up when they stop. It's hilarious. Starting to get a bit annoyed with that, are you? Okay, let's do Opal tomorrow. I am trying with you. But you are a difficult cat to get to like. Very difficult. Right, up to the school now and we'll see if we can give Pebbles something. I need to make sure there are presents available for Pebbles and Deputy Captain. I'm not. I can't. I can't bear to talk to more than a few people at once about the whole airship thing because they all have basically the same dialogue. Ah, oh, I can't believe you're doing an airship, and then it's like, really. Right. Yeah, I love the way they've done the school. I think it's so nice. I, like That's kind of what I was trying to model Andy's room on a bit, like having the tent in there and all that stuff. So Pebbles wants to talk to me. You can have it. Thanks. I'll give it to my kid. I like it. That's for you. And we're also, because I keep missing you, gonna play a round of critters. I don't do this very often anymore. It's definitely helped as we've gone along. Especially for characters that can't spar. And especially for characters that you can't do much with. Ooh. Wasn't expecting that. Are you having one of those rounds where you only play cat? No. Okay. Pebble sometimes has rounds where he just plays cat the whole the whole way through. Okay, that was fun. That was really cool, Pebbles. Pebbles is still not my best friend, but how far through that final star are you now? Right, so if we can just work on getting into this final star. It might take a few days worth of presents to do, but we can. Macchiato and Banjo are like so super close. They've got one little tiny toe to go now. Meerkat still has loads to go and so does Coco. I don't know what's going on with them. I don't know if they just aren't getting sent out on missions or what's going on with them. Okay, so now we've done that and I feel a little bit better about having pebbles liking me and stuff. I'm going to head out to the mole caves. And I'm going to try and find the rest of the... The 
the rest of the wild goose pagoda. And then we're going to get all the way down to level 11, which we've never actually done in this particular mine for some bizarre reason. So I want seven and eight for the pagoda and we need piece two. Why is it always piece two? I swear. Where's piece two that we find last? I'm going too quickly, stressing you out. Do you need longer days than you already have, even though they take you like over an hour per day? Then make longer days. Yay. Excitement. Um, right, let me just dig on through here. Didn't see anything there in the way of relics at all. I feel like I need to sneeze. Now I said it, I probably won't, but maybe I will. We'll see. It'll be a nice surprise for you, won't it? Processors. No, no, no. Not what I need. I think I'll have another chamber I can look in before the end of this level. This was actually a lot more, you wouldn't believe, but this was a lot more irritating in Porsche because uh, all of the relics were jumbled up uh, around all the different layers, so you didn't ever know where... Oh, it's gonna be like one of these, isn't it? You didn't ever know where or on which level your relics were gonna be. So it could be any level. At least here I know what level to look on. <laughs> it's like, Look on every single level, and when we when it got to the point where you just needed a couple left, oh, it was, it was tedious. Oh my goodness. Those of you that were with me at that time will probably still remember that. Expert toolbox processor. Yay! There it is. Just what we needed. Okay, so now we need to go down to level ten and find our way through to level 11. This is one thing I would uh, give as advice, is if you do feel that things are moving too fast and you're not able to do the like sort of day-to-day -day things that you're wanting to do uh, in the game, then just hold up the main quest for a day or two. And it will just help you give get that little bit of balance. But otherwise, it can seem like all you're doing is quest, 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 and you never have time to mine, you never have time to find relics, you never have find time to do anything. And I'm probably the worst for that because I, a lot of stuff has been left like very to the end. Hmm, interesting. It looks like I'm meant to go up there, maybe. Yeah. I love the mole caves. And then down here? I have zero clue what I'm doing here. I feel like I may be running in a circle right now. Away. Uh. 
I don't know. I've definitely been here before. I feel like I'm in the twilight zone. Definitely saying go down. Go this way. Okay, well I at least haven't been here before because it's somewhere I need to mine through. I was extremely lost there. Why is it still saying that's the way back? Oh, this is terrible. I found it, I found it. The way out. I thought that I was like lost in some, some Grecian labyrinth. Oh yeah, I've never been down here. An elegant clothes rack, wonderful. Three relic bags and windy sonata. How lovely. Right, so level 11 down here um, is not where we're finding the spaceship engine, but it is where we may find pieces of the long wall. That is what we're looking for. It is level 11, I believe, of the northern spaceship ruins. Long wall piece 2 and piece 5. So that's two pieces of it already. Another piece 2. Long wall piece... Five is there. Okay, let me run down here. Okay, good, good. Uh, piece five again. It does tend to want to give you all of the same pieces. Uh, I'm not going to worry too much about going after that. There might be another layer underneath, maybe? I don't know. Not sure. So we've only got one layer here, so I will probably just keep reloading it until I either run out of stamina or have all the pieces. Right, so I think we've got one, three, one, four, and three to do. I think it's a five piece. It's a five piece relic. I am not seeing any more. So I'm going to go back to level 10. And then I will reload level 11 so I don't have to go all the way through level 10 because level 10 is an absolute nightmare. And let's see what we can find this time. Same layout today. Anything, 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 please. Lots down there, though. Okay, let's get down there, then. So we've got processor, 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 gravity motor, processor, processor, and piece two. Pretty sure we already had piece two. I'll grab any pieces I find though. Expert toolbox. I don't know if there's like somewhere else we can go. Oh look, yes, yeah, it is bigger than that. Okay, cool. Um, however, no, this looks like, it does look like the bottom there. Okay. This 
is the way back up if I should want to go up again. It's all also worth looking at whether you can just go up. But no, I think I need to reload it again. Oh, or leave ruins and go back in, or whatever I want to do. I'll properly reset it and see if I get anything different by going out and in. It might be interesting to see what the difference is. Not much of a difference from going up and down levels by the looks of it. Really is nothing there. Processor, great. Oh, okay. A couple of pieces that I haven't got there. Right. Nice, 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 nice. Just got to find them. So we've got one and three. So now we are looking for all. They're all ones and threes. We're one piece. We're one piece short now. And I think it's piece four. Oh, where's the great and long wall? Great and long wall. Piece one, two, three. Uh, yeah, piece four. We're missing. So I'm gonna leave and I'm gonna come back in. And we're gonna reset it again. And see if piece four pops up. If it does, then we're done with the mole cave. Once we're done with the mole cave, so we've done Eufaula, then we've done Gecko. Mole cave is the third one. Then it's only the northern spaceship ruins that we need to go through and get everything out of. We may already have some of those. I'm not sure. We'll find out when we get there. That does unfortunately mean lots of trips on Daisy Duck. But if I can find that today, I would be really, really happy. If I could just spend a day on each ruin, finishing off the, the relics on it, that would be perfect. Or not even a day, like an evening or something. It took a couple of evenings, actually, because I kept getting disrupted by fashion shows <laughs> when it came to the, uh, the gecko one. The Eufaula one we had done ages ago. Nothing there. Sad times, but... Don't you need... I don't need your Scro Scrooge McMall. No, no, no. I don't need you. Well, I think then... I need to do another reset. If I leave it, it costs me 50 goals less. But I think it's slightly quicker to load if I don't leave, so... I think I'll be alright for money. I'm at a point where I think the game is expecting me still to be saving for um, my large yard upgrade and lots of big things, but I've already done them, so don't, like don't need to. Okay, nothing there right now. Dig down. Processor, piece two. Processor, gravity motor, expert toolbox. Oh, there's more than that, actually. Yes! It is done. It is done, my peeps. Right, now, do we have time to, like, really super quickly... I think we do. Go over to um, Daisy Duck and just go and have a look, if nothing else, at the northern spaceship ruins and what we can find in there. Um, so I'm going to go and see if I can find most of the relics in there. And if I do, then I'll start looking at getting the motors. Yes, I want to ride Daisy to the Northern Plateau. 
I'm super pleased with myself. We'll go and do things like put the rusty robot and the long wall and everything into the museum and the wild goose pagoda. Probably a lot of them are large relics. I'm hoping a lot of these five part ones will be large relics and then they'll fill the place out a bit more because it was looking a bit empty. There was too many medium relics and not enough of everything else. Okay, so Starship Abandoned Ruins. Let's have a look what we've got. We do not yet have a full hot pot lamp. We do have a Dancing Lion doll, I think. We definitely have the flag-waving astronaut, I'm pretty sure. We definitely have the golfing astronaut. We don't have the inflated astronaut, I don't think. We have... Do we have the guitarist? Don't know. We certainly don't have a buckyball or a fairy fox mask. We don't have... We do have an orchid vase. I don't know if we have a plum vase. We definitely have the chrysanthemum and the bamboo, so we don't need that. We have the coral horn, so we don't need that. Um, I don't think we have the satellite model from level 11, though. So I think the first one we'll look for will be the hot pot lamp. Let me just see if I've got that. I might have it and not have realised, but... It'll be easy to spot, because it'll be bright orange. No, we are missing piece two. Let's go in on level one then and try and find piece two of the hot pot lamp. Let's buy a pass. And in we go. Piece two of the hot pot lamp. I think we, we probably could have found it a hundred times over, to be honest. The amount of time. Oh, okay. Luck is with us. Lady Luck is with us today. So I'm thinking we have the Dancing Lion doll, but I will check. Dancing Lion doll. I'm not seeing that. So let's head to level two and look around for a Dancing Lion doll. I may have pieces of it and just not be able to see it, but it might just be a one-time thing. Dancing Lion Doll, piece two. Well, at least I know how many pieces there are now, that there are more than one piece. That's good to know. Right, now I know I'm looking for what I'm looking for. Let's go and have a look and see what how many pieces there are of it, that sort of thing. There we are, Dancing Lion piece two, and I haven't got any of them. So we're looking for one and three of that then. We're doing great though. I might have to leave in a minute though. Getting too late for poor little she labs to be out and still be able to get home. Yeah, I think I need to leave. But we now have a hot pot lamp and we've finished all of the uh, other ruins. Um, all of the, not the gecko, the mole cave ruins. So the mole cave is completely done. See if I can get myself home in time. Well, it's not the fastest bounce, but we'll see. It may happen, it may not. Right. Back home we go. Oh, I should easily make it home. And yeah, like I say, once I'm done with all of this, I'll head into the... Well, maybe next episode I'll push the storyline along a bit. And I'll Don't just go and... I'll go and find those um, spaceship... Uh, engines, maybe, because otherwise it's just a bit boring, isn't it? It's just a big old relic hunt, and that does get a bit boring after a while. Even if we are at a point where we're not too far off being done, 
But maybe once I found the three engines, I can look for one more. Uh, maybe look for the toy lion doll or something. Oh, that's ghost bed. And see what this Baba wants. What do you want? What do you want? Every day is a fresh start. Morning. Buddy became my close. So that is really good. What other nice toys do I have? I've got a nice... Uh, you're not so keen on the dancing lion thing. Tin frog? <laughs> no, not tin frogs. Okay. Buddy. Good day. Hmm. What? It's your birthday. You've got to do two now. <laughs> Are you going to want uh, uh, me to do a party for Buddy's birthday as well? Mm -hmm. Alright then. I guess we're doing a birthday party for you then, are we? Honey. Mm. A steamed scarab omelette. Thank you very much. Oh, I still haven't made those stupid sandfish traps for Andy. Oh, I'm a nightmare. I swear I'm a nightmare. Right, let's just make a few. And I'm going to forget where they are. I may have gone past them already. Hang on a minute. They're definitely here. There they are. There's a few of them. Oh no! Transmission shafts are needed! Yikers! Right, okay, so Sandy... Uh, Sandy? Andy, for now, it's going to be Scorpsters for a while until I can get enough transmission shafts back through from probably breaking things down. Um, I had loads of them and then I gave them all away from a commission not realising that they were what we needed to make you your stuff. But luckily I have 90 Scorpsters, cool. so... We'll just go with those for a while. I'll maybe make some milk and chestnut on the cooking thing as well, on the cooking station. Milk and chestnut. I'll just make a full 13 of them and then that can be Andy's present until such a time as I can make more sandfish traps. Um, well, apparently I have a birthday to do. When's the big day then, Logan? I feel like this is one of these things that I need to do for him because, like, that's just a nice thing to do. Actually, kidding me? You told me one day before. <sighs> tomorrow, tomorrow. That's fine. Logan's birthday. We will do that at nine o'clock in the morning. That is fine. Before we get, uh, before we have to do anything else, I'll give you a birthday theme with a fancy package. Oh, no, we don't want fireworks and party music. Okay. And I'll probably give him a present as well. Maybe a sharpening stone or something. Okay, so let's go for commissions. Let's see if there's anything that I particularly want to take. Not really. <laughs> Money-wise, I've got 70 grand just sitting in the bank nothing to do with it at the moment anyway so i don't really need to take commissions particularly uh, but what we do need to do probably merle would be the best one for this particular task is go on a birthday uh, invitation giving out uh, ride sadly the only people that i actually need to have points with are people who can't come to the party so, you know. Hi, Hugo! Guess you're gonna be needing bars on bars to get that airship off the ground, hmm. Well, here, take a few of mine. Take a bunch. I want to be able to say that I helped on what could be the biggest project our city ever works on, you know? 
other than changing the desert. Chromium bars. My deputy captain's up here, so I'll give you a opal. If you will stop running away, that would be kind of handy. Deputy captain, come back here. Go into his hangout spot. <laughs> Don't look so annoyed. <laughs> I know I shouted at you and told you to come back. That's my last opal. Hope you like it. Okay. I'll give you an, a, a few spinals after that. Spinals. And he's running away again. So that'll just have to be it. Where are we with Deputy Captain now? Like, please tell me we're getting near. We are, yes. Let's see if I can find Pebbles. Pebbles will or should be at school. Oh no, we've got... Next episode, we're going to have Logan's birthday. And then the episode after, we're going to have the Day of Memories. So much for building my airship. So that's what you've got to look forward to um, tomorrow, or is it going to be one episode Everyone, tonight and one episode tomorrow? To board, I've lost please. count. Wow! Wow! Oh yeah, so we're sat. On, I know we're sat on the border right now. I will do critters. I do really want to get pebbles up to full marks. And then I'm not so worried. Like I said, I'm not worried about the pets. I lost. No. The main thing with the pets was always to get them to, to be my pets. That was the main aim with them. But everybody else. I really... Uh, and... Probably with my second child's ah, a draw. Very well. Well played, Pebbles. My second child, I doubt, is going to be. Ah, no. Pebbles is out playing me today. Oh my goodness. That's a two draws, okay. Plus seven. That's alright. Uh, okay, so with Pebbles, we're still, like, sat there. There's nobody else that's going to go up a level and, and force Pebbles up a level or anything like that. Possibly, uh, the Day of Memories might help me out because that will give me a certain amount per person. And then it looks like we're going to be into things like uh, the Tour de Rock. That's not particularly helpful, nor is the running of the Yakmel next season. So probably Day of Memories and the Wishing Festival are going to be quite useful. Um, they'll also be useful in that Pebbles... If I give Pebbles something different tomorrow, then I'm guaranteed to get 40 points a day across those two days. Which would be quite nice. That might be extremely helpful with wow, my up. pebbles and actually my deputy captain um, increases. So maybe getting some opals for deputy captain. Maybe getting another opal for him tomorrow and then I can give spinel. It doesn't matter too much though. It'll be about 20 points per turn each with them. Okay, so that might be really helpful for those two having a couple of days worth of festival as much as i'm like oh the dear memories ha, ha, how annoying i've got to do a festival it's going to be helpful for one of the things that i'm trying to do right so what, what else have i got to do now um give out party invites well the town center will be the place to do it hey there where's the party invites where are they Hmm? An invitation? You couldn't spell party without Arvio. Well, I guess you can, but why would you? Well, let's have all the party people there. Let's have Pablo. The Mini Botanica is great news for our fleeting youth tea society. We now have a new activity. 
Flower arrangements. Amira and Heidi will love it for sure. Oh, they absolutely will. It's like a dream come true. Ernest was right. I really just needed to put my mind to it. You did. Would you like to come to a party? <laughs> you might be fashionably late. Okay, that's fine. Unsure look kind of sharp up there. Uh, don't tell him I said <laughs> Why weren't you there, Justice? You would have made a really good model. But Unsure kind of has a bit more swagger than you, I think. He's got a little bit more, like, stage soon. presence. <laughs> don't forget to take part in the chase of memories. Well, would you like and to come on, to a party? Mm-hmm. He'll be there. Trudy? Hey there. I feel like it'd be good to try and see if I can get Elsie to come. Thank you. Mm, Katori still needs to talk to me about the airship. Airship, huh? Well, I could give you some golden goose tokens to help you out when you're on a break. Nah, that's a cop out. Here, take a bonus from this month's Katori World Profits. None of that would have been possible without you. Thank you. Wow. You do it. You know, I was supposed to be getting um, percentages from the golden, from the golden goose. You, you know that, right? I haven't petted you today. Right. So, oh, Nia would be a good one to come. My best friend can come, and then the mini botanica marks too. the beginning of my professional life in Sandrock. It's my first venture, and I'll do whatever it takes to make it thrive. What do you think? Beautiful, right? Hmm. I win fried rice. I probably have it, but oh well. Come to a party instead. I'll make you forget all about the high wind fried rice. <laughs> yeah, we've got at least a few people coming now. I'm going to see if I can find where Elsie is. She might be at her pause. No, it doesn't look like it. Oh no, she is. She is. I'm not inviting Cooper. He'll just talk all the time. I want to invite else. Trudy's good friends with uh, Logan as well. I'm trying to think who he would like to have nice there as well you. as who I, I would. I went shopping at the Mini Botanica, and Mia and Mia and kindly gave me some free flowers to brighten up the old ranch. But the next morning, the Yak Mouse had eaten them all and got upset stomachs. My old man wasn't too happy about it. Oops. Come to a party. It will cheer you up. It's Logan's birthday party. Okay. <laughs> right then. So let's go. I really do need to invite everybody I want to invite. So let's see who else is around. don't think I can invite. I've invited Justice, Trudy, Pablo. Mint's up there, but we can't invite Mint. Let's see if like, maybe some people are up here. Wandering about. Apparently no one is wandering about. Uh, Miana's around somewhere. I bet she'd like to come to a party. She's doing stuff at her workshop. This feeling of controlling your own destiny is magical. I'm loving every moment of it. Whoa, these are prettier than anything I own. Maybe I need to buy some. Talking about the clothes, I think. Right. This is the problem when there's so many people and you don't get to talk to Thank them all you. after things like that happen straight away. If something, if someone breaks something, I'll fix it while you carry on hosting. Oh, bless her. That's so cute. Mm. How many invites have I got left? Three. Let's see if uh, Dombey and Ryan are in. It's nice to have another couple, right? Another couple with a baby. I kind of know what we're going through right now. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> um, 
Yeah, I will be inviting Val. I'm sure I saw her just outside. Come on, fill in. Oh. Saying she's inside. She might be upstairs then, maybe. And then I've just got one more person to invite. Nia's planning skills are top notch. The flowers she grows in the moisture farm are the healthiest I've ever seen. Wow, Pablo's so talented. I really want some. Everyone wants Pablo's loads. Thank you. I have to go tell Riri about this. Invite him too if you haven't already. Ah, they come as a pair. I didn't invite. I was inviting Riri without invite. Oh, Grace, you'll be the last person, I think. That would be really nice because you're a part of the Logan gang. So I feel like that would be a perfect last person to invite. Hmm? Right, okay, so that's the big day all sorted out and invitations um, handed out. Uh, Sandy is right. going to give me something. Don't stray too far into the desert. Remember. Ah, Sandy noodles. <laughs> Thank you, Sandy. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how you came across those, but um, thank you so much. So let's ride out across to the northern spaceship ruins. And I think I'm going to try and find those uh, spaceship engines. I, th I think we might do that. But if I have any time left over after that, we'll come back and we'll get some other relics. So at the moment we're looking for the dancing toy uh, lion statue thing. But there's quite a few things in the lower levels that I already have. So uh, it's not too bad. And then it's going to be a case of just um, spamming hazardous ruins so I can buy relic bags from the civil court as much as possible. Until I get all the final relics I need, uh, while also sand fishing. But let's go down to level 11, and uh, I might be able to find the tin frog and the satellite model down there. Those are certainly things I don't already have, as far as I'm aware. I definitely have level 9 and 10. And I think... I have the plum and orchid vases. I definitely don't have the inflated astronaut model from level 5, but I think I have 3 and 4. So I think it's just the toy lion, the inflated astronauts, the buckyball, and the fairy fox mask on 7. And then um, the Tim Frog and Satellite model on 11. So 2, 5, 7, and 11 we don't have. It's not too bad, actually, is it? So let's go down to 11. I'll see if I can find the relics down there, as well as finding the spaceship engines I need. Fingers crossed. Let us see. High-speed motor. Just making sure that doesn't count as a spaceship engine. One of the pieces of the Tim Frog. High speed motor, all in one tool box. Let me just double check the mission and make sure. You'll need to go to the 11th layer of the ruins to be sure. Okay, so it's de we're definitely in the right place. Is th this is it. This is the one. These things that were sticking up. Oh, well, that's pretty easy then. Is there another one? Yeah. I 
getting as happy as I am to be coming in here and finding tin frogs and, and stuff, um, I am actually going to go and hand that straight in. Because uh, I'm at a point where there's not much going on each episode in the way of storyline. I like to keep it kind of ticking, at least. As, as well as giving myself enough time in the episode to, to do things like hunt for relics. So we're going to go back to the moisture farm. And uh, I think Chi wanted these, so I'll hand them in to him. So it should be just down the road from where I land, if I'm right. Yeah, let's go straight over to Cheese before it shuts. Let's see what he has to say about my beautiful spaceship engines. Hey, Callie. Callie's so cute. Uh, you need to be aware of things that are too cute. I was watching the Doctor Who with the meek. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Splendid. Mint and I will start her analysis right away. Oh. By the way, it seems everyone in town has taken great interest in this project. It is one yeah. of the largest things ever built by mankind in our current era, so I kind of, as they say, get it. Many members of our community insist they want to help. Therefore, I have told them that there is no harm in procuring materials for a large project. I cannot, however, speak to the value of set materials. Nevertheless, it may be worthwhile yeah. to speak with people around town. Good luck. Some I'll things try to get are like lots of money. Diagram for the airship to you as soon as possible. And some things are like one copper gear or something. <laughs> the airship diagram proved to be more exciting than I had initially anticipated. Never judge a book by its cover, or rather, exercise caution when judging a diagram solely on your first impression. Yes, that's what it should be. Hmm. No, I don't have any extra components for you. My contribution was telling you that extra components may be acquired by speaking with other community members around town. If I had something to give you, I would have given it already. Good luck. That was rude, asking him for extra stuff. My goodness. Right. Let us head out. And, uh... Wait for diagrams. Oh, X has something for me as well. See, I wonder if this is affected by uh, the love of the people around for you, how much they like you. Don't land on his shoulder! Oh, man. The fashion show is different. Better. You enjoyed yourself. You had a fun mm. time doing the fashion show. You definitely did, Fang. So X has something for me, but only when X is not on Fang's shoulder. <laughs> I wasn't fast enough, clearly. Um... So actually, as much as I've ridden back over from there, I probably just want to go back and start digging for relics because I now have the spaceship pieces. And then we will start on the airship, which will probably be a huge commission. It'll be massive. It will test my factory to its fullest potential. It will require every type of wood and every type of metal, and every type of scrap. Right, so I think the first thing I should do is look and see if I do or don't have the plum vase pieces. That was definitely something I didn't know whether I had or not. And then we'll go and start looking for the toy lion again. Oh, hang on. Plum bars. Plum bars, plum bars, plum bars. Orchid vase piece one. Plum bars piece two. We don't have plum bars piece one. So I can go and look at that after I've done my toy lion. So we'll do toy lion. Flag waving astronauts. Golfing astronauts. Let me just check those. 
Flag waving and golfing astronauts. The golfing, I don't have pieces of. The flag waving, I don't have pieces of. Wow, okay. So this is maybe not as complete as I thought it was. Oh, hang on. Flag, flag waving piece. One, two, three, four. Astronaut piece. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Guitarist. One, two, three. So I do have them, I've just put them together, that's why. Okay. We're definitely missing... Pieces of the armor display piece, sadly. So I'd need to try and find where piece 2 and 4 are of that, but that's their treasure chest only, which is going to be a rough one. It's going to be really rough. Unless um, there is a wiki that can tell me where they are. Something entirely missing there. Tin frog. I'm guessing the satellite will be three pieces. The dancing lion is three pieces there. Okay. Okay, so that's not as bad as I thought. So yeah, we we have the flag waving. We have the golfing. We don't have the inflated. Oh, that'll be the one that's missing then, the inflated astronaut. We do have the guitarist, I think, or at least pieces of the guitarist. All right, let's head in and get the dancing lion. Pieces one and three, I think. No. No. Dancing Lion piece two. Well, wonderful. I think that's pretty much the piece we already had. And sadly, it's only this level like that this is on. You don't seem to have many multiple level things for... Apparently this is not the way. Um, no, it is the way, right? Oh, here we, are. here we are. Up this way, I think. Do we have any relics up there? I think I think we do. Okay, cool. Let's have a look. Where we are? Oh, there. there. Up one more floor than that. Okay. Let's see then, Lion Doll piece 3. Perfect! Exactly what we needed. And Lion Doll piece 1? I should be so lucky. <gasps> Yay! Lion is done. Right, so onwards and upwards. I believe we've done these ones. So, inflatable astronaut model. Or inflated astronaut model. Followed then by piece two of the plum bars, I think. Oh, that's piece one. Once you've got piece one, I can see how many pieces it has. I think it's three. This is a, this is a big area, so there's a good chance I'll get a lot of stuff. I want to be out of here relatively early so that I've got a chance of getting to the birthday party looking half decent. Oh, it's got four pieces, hasn't it? Okay. We've got one, three, and four, so I think we're just looking for two. Unless it's a five-piecer. And there's two. I love it when a plan goes smoothly. I'm here, you. Right. 
Let me just check that I did get all the pieces. So we are looking for the inflated astronaut model. So we've got all of those pieces, lovely. So that means everything down to here, which is the armor display piece, is all done. We've got one vase piece missing. Something missing there, something missing there, something missing there. Tin frog, and that's probably the satellite. Okay, well this is certainly filling a lot of stuff in. Right, so next we need to find the plum, or do we? No, we need, need to find the buckyball and the kid and the fairy fox mask, then the plum bars. So let's see what we can find of that. Buckyball one. then allow me to see how many pieces of the buckyball are actually available and the fairy fox mask should be in here as well I'm guessing I just kind of skipped right through this level previously and didn't really pick up anything because I have nothing of these fairy fox mask piece one so now at least we have pieces of them so I can see how much is missing piece two one. Oh, I always forget what I've even picked up, so let's just grab it. Or maybe I did grab it already. Okay. So, let's have a quick review of what we got there. Buckyball piece one. There's only two pieces of the buckyball. Fairy Fox Mask piece 2 and piece 1. So we just need Buckyball piece 2. Right, let's um Let's go through actually. This might be Plum Bar's plate uh place. Layer 8. What was on layer 8? Yeah, Plum Bar's piece 2 on here, layer 8. Orchid, plum one, orchid two, and orchid one. <gasps> Everything but what we needed. We're at half past nine. It's gonna probably take me a couple of days to get through all of this. There's a lot to find, to be fair. High speed motor, orchid one. Where's the way down? Oh no, let me through. Come on. Let me down, down, down. Orchid? No, that's orchid piece two. Grr. No idea where I'm going right now. Um, I'm going. To, I'm a bit lost, so I'm going to go back to level seven and see if I can find Buckyball piece two. Very fox two. Toolbox, Buckyball one, box two. Oh, that's annoying. One and 
one toolbox, fairy box one, fairy box two. And I'm gonna need to leave probably shortly after midnight. Like I say, I've got a big birthday party to do tomorrow. Yes, buckyball two. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so now let's go down to level eight and see if we can find plumpies too. Then we've done those. We've done that. We just need the tin frog and the satellite model finished off. So we'll see. It won't be today, but I think we found a lot of the preliminary stuff. We're just going to need to mosey about on level 11 a little bit more. Which isn't too bad, right? What we got? Yes! I can see it. I just got to get to it. Okay, so looking at it now, what have we got? I think a lot now. Yeah, obviously still wait, missing armor display piece that's standing out like a sore thumb. Something between the ferris wheel and the sundial. And I have no idea what it is. Something there that's missing. And I've gone through all of the mole cave. I believe I have anyway. Oh no, was it plum piece one? Oh no, that's irritating. Now I've got a thing full of plum. Oh, I'm sure I had plum ones earlier on as well. Oh, there's one over there. Okay, let's gra grab it. Let's go. Yeah, we've got plum piece one now. So yeah, there's one relic there that I just don't know what it is. Or where to get it, or, or how to get it, or what to do about it. Um, so I am going to head out now and go home. But we found most stuff now. Most of the relics. So I'll have to see what it is that's between the ferris wheel and the... No, wrong one. <laughs> I want Daisy. What's between the, the ferris wheel and the next thing on from that? I don't know what that'll be. I'm pretty sure I've been through everything. But it, it looks like it's a mole cave thing that's missing. So maybe there's something I missed in the mole cave. I can go back there and have a look. And see if anything shows up that I haven't managed to pick up. Uh, there's every chance I might have just like slightly, slightly overlooked something in the mole caves. It looks like I've maybe missed a level or something actually. So I will check that out once I've finished the Northern Starship Ruins and we'll do that while probably alongside um, building this new spaceship. I'm very, very happy to have gotten those spaceship engines and we're going to be getting having a party tomorrow and then we're going to be getting diagrams so we can start work on the spaceship stuff probably while Logan's having his party actually. It wouldn't be too bad to do that, right? Just pop in and say hello to everybody and then, you know, sneak out and do a bit of work. <laughs> but yeah, that's going to be it for me today. I'm going to head back into my house. That was a good episode there. We got a lot done. I made a lot of progress on the relics. So once we've made all the progress on the relics, we're going to be making progress on the fish. That's my next project after that. I'm just doing it like little projects. Each, each, uh... Ruin is a different pro like little mini project for me, effect effectively. And I, I'm enjoying it like that, I think. Otherwise, I think it would be a bit too overwhelming. Don't know where I'm going to find the armor stand stuff, though. That's going to be a bit of a challenge. And getting enough relic bags to get the final two pieces I need. I'll probably have to go through hundreds of relic bags to find those, no doubt. Monument piece two and that piece of the sword soldier. Ugh. But anyway, 
I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.